my friends. Um, I was shopping over the weekend, as you can probably see here, and before I put it away, I wanted to go ahead and share it with you. Um, I, I did a lot of shopping on things that were on sale, and so I... I did a little bit of damage here, but I just wanted to show you. Um, let me go ahead and start over here. Uh, these were some things that actually I didn't, I had ordered on Amazon some um, stones or, I don't know if you'd call that beading. I bought some of those. Um, I got quite a bit of this and I can't even remember how much I got, but um, I got six of these packages for about seven or eight dollars and then I got some of these which they're gorgeous and they're really really clear so beautiful so I'm going I've got a project for that in mind okay and um, I will also show you um, I went my first place that I went to was Michael's and um this these lights are i have in mind for to go with those beadings or those crystals um these were uh, 50 percent off and i think they were ten dollars but they were 50 percent off i got two boxes of those so that's um that's one idea that i had um let's see while I was at Michael's, um, I, I wanted to start working in a journal. So um, they had their journal things on sale, and I ended up going with this, um, the Happy Planner. I liked it um, with the uh, how big the pages are and how big the blocks are. So... Um, it shows a month at a time and then a week at a time. So I really liked that. So I may go more into that one day in another video. And along with that, I wanted to, I found these project goals sheets that you insert. And I thought those might come in handy. So I picked a package of those up. I forget how much they were. I think they were maybe five dollars. The book was on sale. I think I got it for twenty for twenty dollars. And then they had these um, sticker sets. Um, I think they were yeah a dollar forty nine on sale from five ninety nine. I got two of those, and so that'll work for in my project book. And let's see. Um, while I was there, I saw this little sh um, pack of paper, 24 sheets, 6 by 6 and I thought the paper was really pretty, where flowers bloom. So, I got that. I love working with small packages of the 6 by 6 and sheets. Um, and then I picked up some single sheets, things that I have been... Um, that I was thinking of working with. This is actually it's a sheet, um, a clear sheet, and let's see if I can put. Um, it says this is hard to read. Let me see if I can find another sheet to put it on. Here, I'll put it up against this black, this white. Um, it says some beautiful things. Sorry for the glare. But that, I thought that was really pretty. And I picked up a couple of these, this gold glitter paper. Um, I've been working with that some, so I picked up a couple sheets of that. And then this texture paper, I thought it is just beautiful. And I love working with that, especially like in mini albums. So um, I uh, picked up a sheet of that. Okay. Then, uh, let's see, they had these. Those were, sorry. Um, see, I think I got these. Um, these were... Uh, 
washi tape. These little packages, um, $4.99, but it was on sale 50% off. But they were cute. I like the thin ones, the narrow. I want. I needed some of the narrow types. So I got that, and then I got these that were real narrow. I thought I might use some of this in my journaling. So I got that, and I picked up a couple of recollect recollections. Recollection. I'm sorry, recollections. Um, I'm sorry about that. Um, stickers for the journal, for my journal, my planner. And so I picked up a couple packages of those. I can't remember the price of those, but I thought those were pretty. Okay. And I've been looking for a circle punch, a one and a half inch. And so I found it at Michael's. Unfortunately, I went to Hobby Lobby and then they had their had theirs on sale, so I messed that up a little bit, but that's okay. And then the next place I went to, I went to oh, let me show you some flowers that I um found at they were having some sale of flowers outside of Michael's and so I got a couple of these little like it's almost like a bouquet. I think I got that for five dollars and this one also I love the colors in that and um, let's see I found this vase or vase um, metal and it was I think I got it for like five dollars and I thought it's just beautiful so with some long stem flowers. I thought I could put a bouquet in that. And then I also found these flowers. I'm going to come over to here. Over to, I have them sitting in this chair. And they, they had some bunches um, that were on sale. I, let's see. I think most of these were at least 50% off. Maybe 75 uh, This one was $9.99. And I know it was at least 50% off. Okay. Um, this, uh, uh, like a fern. I wish I would have had uh, found more than just one. And actually that was $14.99. And I know it was maybe 75% off. Okay. This is another like bouquet. I thought it was gorgeous. Love these. And I want to say this was $15. Yeah. And I know it was at least at least 50% off. So okay. And then I wanted to pick up some different colors. I thought those were pretty. These, that was $7.99, so I know it was at least, it was probably $3 for that. Let's see. That is so pretty. And let's see how much that was. That was $12.99, so it was probably about $5, maybe $5 or $6.00. Uh, let's see. I think that, yeah, this uh, orange I think I already showed you was in, I, I guess I got two of those. And some more pink. Those are gorgeous. It was $7.99. Those are so beautiful. All right. Let me put these back over here and I will show you some more of the things that I purchased. Okay, um, I found these in the dollar spot, these little boxes. I thought I could do something with those. So that, that's going to be kind of fun to do, to paint and decorate. I got two of those. They were like a dollar, maybe two, but I, they may have been just one. And this, 
I thought I could use when I'm doing cake pops. Um, lay this down on top of styrofoam and then stick my cake pops in there. So I got that. Then I went to Hobby Lobby and um, I bought some uh, more washi, just solid colors. And I know everything was at least 50% off that I bought. And I think there was one one thing that I, I'll show you that in a minute. And I used my coupon. Some more washi. Some like rose gold. And of course I got my favorite tape. I think I got one of the quarter inch and three of the half inch. And I was running out of... Well, I'll show you these. I found these blue jars, and I have an idea for these. I thought they were beautiful, and they're going to, I think they're going to be beautiful in what I have in mind. So I bought two of those, and those were on sale. Uh, let's see. $7.99. I know they were at least 50% off. Okay. Let's see. So I got two of those. And I was running out of letters so I picked up a few I, I got some gold some smaller gold two packages of those and those are this is you can't hardly tell but it's like a rose gold those are real pretty these were some uh, pink and it has like a each one has like a little rhinestone on it I thought that was kind of cute. I saw this and I thought, um, I'm always thinking of stickers for, um, for many, many albums. So I saw that and I thought I would grab that. And I saw these letters, Petals and Blooms. And they were on sale for $1.99 a pack, so I grabbed two of those. They had their gems on sale for 50 cent, uh, fifty percent off, and it, this was two ninety nine, so it was a dollar fifty for that. And then I got some frames; those were fifty percent off. These are it was three ninety nine, so it would be two dollars. I got some square ones and then some oval ones. All right, and let me show you what I was looking for. Um, Let's see if I can get that out. I let's see if I can move this. Besides my Cricut and my whoops, besides my Cricut and my Big Shot, um, I sometimes like to like if I'm gonna um cut out just a plain circle or and edging I have been using these where you get a sheet of these and uh, they're plastic and this is the one I use the most okay and it's a Fisker um, and I, I use this one the edge a lot I don't know if you can see I use that edge quite a bit on um, when I'm making my photo albums and this is the Fisker and this is the cutter in which you do let me show you I love this thing um, well I'll just show you what you do is you lay this on top of your paper and then you slide this around the outside and it cuts it's got a blade in it and it cuts that shape out so I use that a lot and but my blade was getting dull so I wanted to find some replacements and I couldn't find any so I did pick this up and hope this is about the same thing um, so this is the knife contour the cello so I hope that's the same thing I went ahead and picked up some spare blades for it so Hopefully, that'll work. But anyways, um, so I that's what I've got at Hobby Lobby. Oh, and this 
Okay, I wanted to decorate that. I know a lot of people, I know you've probably seen this decorated quite a bit. It's just a cardboard letter. Uh, it was $9.99, but I know it's 50% off. Um, oh, the Fisker was $19.99, but this is what, it wasn't on sale, but I used my 40% off on it. That's what I used it for. Um, so, I think that's everything. Oh, um, let me go back to, uh, Michael's had this out sale, I mean outside for sale. And uh, this basket with wire on the sides. I thought I could use that in when my expansion on my craft room is finished. I could use that. I stopped and, oh, oh, one more thing. Um, I wanted to pick up some of these, um, these piece, gem pieces. I have an idea I'm going to use those for. And so I got two different sizes. I got the, I think it's one and a half inch and these are the one inch. So I picked up some of those. And here's my, my big fine. And I saw this right when I was checking out and I couldn't help it. I had to go back and get it. It was in a cart where somebody had returned it. But with my expansion, I love this. So I went back and picked it up, got back in line and paid for it. But look, the price was originally $199 and I got it for $50. So of course, I, I know my husband could have made that for me. Okay. And I went back and I know you, I've had a haul where I've gone to Harbor Freight. I went back over there because I saw a another chair over there that I liked. Um, and this one, I don't have to have a back on my chair because I, I like to sit up straight. So I usually don't lean back on the back. So I went back over there and picked up that seat. I know it's for a man, but I've looks really comfortable and I think it's going to be the right height um, once I extend it for what I'm going to need so I'm glad of that um, but anyways and I also stopped at Lowe's and you'll see this wood here and I know my husband he said I wished I know he could have made these pieces for me but I have another project I'm going to make with those and I got this metal piece because this metal piece is what's going to hold them together and so I'll be showing that to you and along with that I got sanding tools and um, some uh, braces um, some double robe hooks some stain sandpaper I think that's all I got but yes, um, that was my haul, and uh, like I said, I was a shopper, so, um, actually it was last Monday I went, so, um, I can't wait to show these projects that I have for you, and put them together for you, so comment below and subscribe, I appreciate you, you have a great rest of the day, and thank you for watching.